Kids Chat with Canadians Abroad, and I am with Glenn Brayshaw and Mike Nyas. So first of all, I'd love to know, um, I know that you guys bought this in 2009, and it's obviously overgone some major changes, and it was a Trent Jones. A Robert Trent Jones Golf Course. Robert Trent Jones. I have to brush up Bobby on my golf. Designer name, they yeah. say anyways, if you, you know, <laughs> if you ask somebody. But it's overgoing some major changes, and I'd love for you guys to tell us about uh, why you bought it, and why this course, and, and the changes that you're making to it. Okay, I think the reason we bought it is, like most Canadians probably living down here in California, we wanted the weather and the lifestyle. <laughs> and we definitely got that because it's end of October here and it's 80 degrees today. Pretty good. And uh, we we're looking for an opportunity. The golf course is a fabulous golf course and it's had something that we're looking for. Uh, 500 acres of raw land around it for development. Um, that's our background coming from Canada. We did a few projects out in the Banff Camor area. And uh, it just had everything right for us that we we're looking for. And obviously the weather and all that stuff is a big part of it. Um, well this is a huge golf community here in uh, Palm Springs. and. Um, it, was this? Were you looking at other properties at the time, or was it really just Palm Springs? Uh, what we, we we looked at a few areas actually: the Lake Las Vegas area, Phoenix, uh, Escondido. But w this particular golf course, in addition to being a, a name brand, as as Mike had articulated, Robert Trent Jones Jr. Uh, the the uh, availability of the sort of an open palette. It's all raw land around there, so we could put our own creativity into the design of the community. And this market has a lot of golf courses with houses around them, but not a lot of lock and leave type condominium product, which is what our clients that we'll be marketing to in Canada are, are more interested in than, than, than whole ownership houses. So who's the ideal you know, clientele that are going to be buying these condos, homes? Well, Palm Springs can be a little agey. Uh, we're looking for something in the little more youthful generation, and we're going have a lot of fun uh, at the property, amenities, services, you name it, and uh, hopefully something a little different, you know, non-Palm Springsy in Palm Springs. Okay. Tell me about these amenities, and I, I want to know more details, like what, what are some of the things that we can expect? Uh, ideally, we want our clients to be able to get on the plane with their phone and their wallet, and everything's there when they get there, and they're ready to start vacationing the minute they arrive. That sounds really incredible and actually really unique to this, uh, to, to the, some of the other homes that you can own and, and places that you can own in this area. Right. Um, so, how are you guys going to reach out to uh, Canadians that are, you know, how will they know about how to, We're you know, buy them here every way we can. <laughs> What, with your, whether it's through WestJet, marketing, track, advertising, right yeah. Now, uh, w what kind of golf course is this? Is this a difficult course? It's tough right now. I, pl it's, I mean, a little short. plays about 6,900 yards, which, again, we'll move that up when the development goes to about 72, 7,300. The better players, uh, you know, they'll go and shoot 63, 64. Um, but there's been pros out there that, you know, have a hard time breaking 80. So it's... It, yeah. If you, it's like any course, you spray the ball a little bit, you're in trouble. Hit it, hit it down the fairway, you can score. So that's that simple. <laughs> and are you two golfers? I, I aspire to be. Okay. You get to golf on your golf course, right? I, we get to golf. If I get to actually go and play a little bit, my game comes around. But when you only play once every 12 days, it's tough to get anything rolling, right? But uh, And he's just got awful. I'm, I'm, I'm actually a three handicap. My handicaps are driving, chipping, and putting. All three? Yes, yeah, so. yeah, all three. Yeah. Well, guys, thank you so much for chatting with us. Thanks, Sam. Awesome show. Thanks for coming out. Thank you, and we look forward to tomorrow to, to this event. Thank right. you. <laughs>